All right, what's going on, everybody? You already know who it is. It is your boy, the Dry Nude here, and today I am going to show you how to use the Motivity uh, Mouse Excel um, setting. Basically, all the clips that you've seen in the beginning were from this, and it's like aim assist. It gives you that aim assist type feeling on mouse and keyboard. It still allows you to flick and everything, but it's a little bit different than the linear option. So basically, we're gonna go right into this. Link will be down in the description below to get this spreadsheet. Also, shout Shout out to the Potato Squad, AKA Leviathan on Discord for helping me out with this. But let's get right into it, man. So you have this setup right here. Basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to file and you're gonna make a copy in the Excel sheet. That way you're gonna be able to edit everything that we're doing right now. So, okay, we're right in. Next thing you wanna do is you wanna come down to the OW forward slash COD slash destiny two. Click on that everything is going to be uh zero right now okay so we're going to enter everything in, and this is going to be different for you but for me i enter in my call of duty sensitivity which right now is 1600 dpi at a two end game okay so basically what we're going to do is we're going to put this input in 16 100 that's your dpi your sense modifier which is going to be a one because it goes on how fast you move your mouse we're going to set that to one and then your desire x to y sense modifier so basically what that is your horizontal and vertical sensitivity i personally like it at the same so we're going to put one into there next thing we're going to have to do is we're going to have to figure out what our 360 uh distance is at the sensitivity that we're comfortable with right now I use mouse sensitivity, same mouse sensitivity, and it's super easy to set up, guys. Basically, you go in here, you change your units to centimeters, and then you just plug everything in. I have Call of Duty Modern Warfare Warzone right there, my sensitivity at two. Your sensitivity two is actually your monitor coefficient, so I keep that at 1.78. Your next thing is your DPI. You can enter your FOV, but the biggest thing is to change it from the config file to end game, okay? We do that, and then that gives us our 360 distance, which is 4.32955. So we're gonna copy that, and we're gonna put that in the maximum desired centimeters, okay? Right here, we put that in, and we're gonna put that right there, like that, okay? Now your minimum desired C M, okay, your 360. I personally like to put it at half. This is what I like. It really helps me out. And this is all dependent on you. If you want it one fourth your sensitivity, or if you want it half or three fourths your sensitivity, kind of slower. Half for me is just easier. So basically, what I do is I go into my calculator, I divide this number, which was 4.3 or 43.2955, divided by two. That's going to give me my half, my centimeter. And this right here is basically what the sensitivity is half so we're going to put that right into our half and then boom enter we get these values okay now sometimes that this messes up so basically you calculate motivity is 1.41 for but we round it up so it tells you your export value your rounded motivity is actually going to be 1.41 okay so we just put in 1.41 enter okay so now it tells me what my sensitivity should be calculated ig sensitivity is 2.83 basically that is what you're going to put into call of duty or the game that you are playing like i said for us it's ow's call of duty slash cold war basically you put that in and this is going to be your new sensitivity 2.83 okay you're going to put that in it's going to feel absolutely amazing next thing you want to do you also can play around with your sensitivity you can put 2.8 whatever it is you want next thing you're going to want to do is you're going to come into here your mouse excel you're going to switch to, to motivity remember why we were using linear before we're going to switch it to motivity and then guys this is going to give you that aim assist like feeling you set your sense multiplier to one your rotation is going to be at zero these are the numbers that you can play with. Your acceleration, you can, I have it at 0.5 right now, but say you don't like 0.5, you can raise it up to 0.8 and look at the curve. The curve is a little more dramatic, but I personally like 0.5. Play around with these settings, guys. It's all up to you, okay? Next thing you wanna do is you wanna put in your motivity, and basically that is this number right here, your rounded motivity, 1.41. Basically, you just put that into here, and then my midpoint, 
I like it at 25. You can play around with your midpoint and play around with your acceleration. That is the beauty about this program and mouse Excel. You can customize it to your situation. So say you want it at like 30, right? And then look what it does to the curve. It makes it a little bit more or less, or say you don't like 30, say you want 10, you could change it to 10. But see how the curve is a little more S shape. You're hitting it a little bit faster when you move your mouse, okay? So it basically, the midpoint is when it kicks in that acceleration. I personally like 25, feels really good to me. And guys, you can play around with your settings in game. I have more of like a linear, but see how it kind of just curves here just a little bit. That curve is what I really like. So basically this is how you set up the Motivity uh, 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 Raw Excel and this is going to help you have that more aim assist feeling. This is what I personally use. Linear is good for beginners, but like I said, this is what I use and this is how I set it up. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. Comment down in the comment section below if you're going to try this. Also, another thing is playing at a higher DPI is gonna help you out a ton. There's actually a video out between the difference, the latency difference between 800 DPI and 1600 DPI. And it's actually a lo way lower latency at 1600 DPI. So that's what I play on now. And that's what I personally prefer right now. So guys, like I said, I hope you enjoyed this video. Always remember to stay blessed and stay humble. And I'll catch you in another video. Peace.